Now we can use the following patterns while simplifying while multiplying. So 96 into 5. So this 96 into 5 can be written as 10 by 2. So then 200, 248 and 48 into 10 is 480. And here 96 into 125. So 96 into 125 can be written as 1000 by 8. Here 8 ones are 8. 8 12 are 96. 12 into 1000. 12,000. So while multiplying 64 by 5. So then 64 into 5 can be written as 10 by 2. 2 32s are 64. 32 into 10 is 320. So then 64 into 25. So this equals to 64 into 25 means 100 by 4. So 4 ones are 4. 16 are 64. So then 16 into 100 is 1600. So we can multiply any two numbers. So by writing the by writing one of the two numbers in the form of 10 by something, 1000 by something. So then we can cancel and multiply by 10, 100, 1000, etc. Now let us see the questions now. Which of the of the first question? Which of the following? will not represent 0. Now the first option is 1 plus 0 so this equals to 1 will not represent 0. Then 0 into 0 equals to 0 then it represents 0 will represent 0 then 0 divided by 2 also 0 so this will represent 0. next 10 minus 10 is 0 by 2 equals to 0 so this also will represent 0 the next question Study the following pattern. Now one plus a one into eight plus one equals to nine. Twelve into eight plus two equals to ninety eight. One twenty three into eight plus three equals to nine eighty seven. So then write. next uh, four steps so the next step is 1 2 3 4 into 8 plus 4 equals to 9 8 7 6 the next one is 1 2 3 4 5 into 8 plus 5 equals to 9 8 7 6 5 the next step is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 into 8 plus 6 equals to 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4. The next step is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 into 8 plus 7 equals to 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3. So this is the pattern observed in the so in the first step 1 into 8 plus 1 equals to 9 and in the second step so 2 is increased means 12 then it is multiplied by 8 and 2 is added then we get 9 decreased by 8 so that is 98. In the third step we have taken first 3 digits 1, 2, 3 multiplied by 8 plus 3 the number of digits then we got the three numbers in the descending order 987. So we can continue the same pattern for any step. Now let us see the next question. Find the following using distributive property. The first question is 728 into 101. 
so this equals to 728 into 101 can be written as 100 plus 1 so if we use distributive property here we can write 728 multiplied by 100 and 728 multiplied by 1 so then 728 into 100 plus 728 into 1 so this equals to 728 two zeros plus 728 one the 728 now this equals to 0 plus 8 8 0 plus 2 2 and 8 plus 7 15 1 plus 2 3 and 7 73,528 the next question 5437 is multiplied by 1001 so here also we can write 1,001 can be written as 1,000 plus 1. So here also we can use distributive property. So 5,437 is multiplied by 1,000 and multiplied by 1. So then we get 5,437 into 1,000 plus 5,437 into 1. So this equals to 5,437. So there are 3 zeros plus 5437 so 5437 three zeros then 5437 yeah 0 plus 7 7 0 plus 3 3 0 plus 4 4 7 plus 5 12 3 plus 1 4 4 and 5 so 54 lakh 42,437 now let us see the next question if the product of two whole numbers is zero can we say that one or both of them will be zero justify through examples now for example the product of two numbers is zero means so either we can take if a into b equals to zero then either a must be zero or b must be zero or both zero so if a equal to zero then zero into b equals to zero if b equal to 0 then a into 0 equals to 0 so if both a equal to b equal to 0 then 0 into 0 equals to 0 so here either 1 or both of the numbers will be 0 if the product of the two numbers is 0 then either 1 or both of the numbers will be 0 for the next question if the product of two whole numbers if the product of two whole numbers is 1 then can we say that one or both of them will be 1 now the product of the two numbers is 1 so then if a into b equals to 1 so then if a equals to 1 then 1 into b equals to b but you are not getting the product 1 so if b equals to 1 then we get a into 1 equals to a but not 1 if both a equal to b equals to 1 then 1 into 1 equals to 1 so then both of the numbers will be 1 if the product of the two whole numbers is 1 then the both of the numbers will be 1 if you like this video please give a thumbs up
please subscribe to our channel to get more videos on CBSE syllabus.